Aloha everyone, this is Cheryl here, aka Gardening with Aloha. Here I have pumpkins that I've picked over the week and my mom wants to take them and cook them up. Here are some farm fresh eggs that I just gathered up. Look at how tiny this egg is. You know, um, this one is from my Cochin. The little chicken, so cute. And look at the comparison. You see how tiny this is a from my Aracana. But you can see the difference. Look. Look at how small that egg is. But you know what surprises me is when I um crack this egg open, the yolk is just as big as a normal size egg. But here are my fresh eggs from the garden. I mean, from my chicken coop today. I got two, four, six, seven. Seven heaven. This is my turmeric in the corner of this little bed. Well, it's not that little, but anyway, look at how big it is. I never seen a turmeric grow this big well i haven't well maybe i did i think the one that f that flowered maybe but this one is growing amazingly well and then i have another one i just love the looks of um the turmeric plants let me show you the other ones here's another one See how beautiful the leaves are. I love everything about this plant. And you know what? Um, I'm doing updates because hopefully they flower again. And if you haven't seen that video before about my turmeric flower, you should go check it out because it it's a quite beautiful, kind of waxy looking white flower with I think it had like yellow in it too but I'll try and link that video below down in the description box and then I have another turmeric hold on that one right there is in a container and I have another turmeric to share a plant look at this one you know what happened was I forgot that I planted turmeric. You know, if if I don't label where I plant ginger or turmeric, I'm not going to know until it comes up. And then I'll say, oh yeah, that's where I planted it. But anyway, this started from a little tiny turmeric bulb. And look at, look at it growing now. And... I got another turmeric. Hold on. This one is right alongside the roadside. See the roads right there and then my turmeric's right here. But again, I'm showing you the turmeric because when it flowers, guys, it's I think you know me, I love my I love any flowers, but I don't know, something about the turmeric just makes me go Ah, oh, yeah, no, like it's such a beautiful flower Speaking of flowers, look at all my French marigolds I can start collecting all the dried up flowers Like, let's see, I don't know if it's really dry Because, you know, it did rain a little bit but look, this, this is exactly how marigold seeds look. Then you can just sprinkle them wherever you want it to go. And I promise this is the last turmeric that I'm going to share. This one is growing alongside um, the tea leaf. The tea leaf plants. But... This one is, I didn't harvest this one the last time 
just left it and then it regrew back wherever you leave a rhizome they're gonna eventually come back but this is the last one and I cannot wait to harvest the turmeric and then dry it and then grind it up for a turmeric powder because the last time it came out so good and you know when I uh, dehydrate bananas um, I do a mixture of some lemon fresh lemon juice water and I sprinkle some turmeric powder and then a little bit of honey and then I dip the sliced bananas in that mixture and then I dehydrate it and it is the bomb. But anyway, mahalo for watching guys. Take care and aloha.